Hello and welcome back to Skyrim. We are continuing our legendary mage playthrough and uh, we are mid a uh, mage's guild quest. Let's get back into first person and pull up the journal. We're doing uh, revealing the unseen and we're I think close to the end of this. So let's uh, investigate further. Get our pets out and continue down. I think we're going into Falmer territory, so this could be uh, could be dicey. I'm not uh not sure how strong the uh, normal ones are gonna be. Oh, there's a uh, poison spitting uh, bug of some sort. This is how it kind of gone from an illusion playthrough to a more of a uh, conjuration playthrough. It's almost too hard to play uh, a full illusion for anything in this. Uh, just got some eggs. There's an ore vein. Let's get that real quick. So yeah, we're gonna finish up this quest and then see how much further we have to go down to finish the Mages Guild. And then I would like to do the uh, Dark Brotherhood quest line. All right, let's get out of here. There's some imps tool we missed. Let's grab that. Let's kind of try to stay stealth as uh these things seem pretty vicious. And if I recall correctly, the Falmer are uh, blind. But they can... Jeez. Alright, well, they should be uh, doing their job. Three or four of them out there. Is that it? What is that? that Palmer Bloom Spurker. Come on. Okay, Alright, he's down. Oh no, what's going on there? No stealth wasn't involved. There we go. Let's keep going. Chitin. Falmer War Axe here. Another Falmer Helmet we don't need. Not sure what the Chitin's for, but we'll take it. Alright, we got some more up there. We can loot. A loot. Ocean healing, reagents, iron boots. All right, let's get this. So I'm hoping to get as many achievements as I can during this playthrough. I have, uh, I've unlocked some, but uh, there's a lot of them. <laughs> I was looking on the uh, the Steam achievement list so my goal is to get every single one of them uh, let's see here steel soldier gauntlets don't need those just leave them pine thrush egg bird's nest and we might have to do some uh, cheesy leveling stuff I think just to get enough uh, of the points to uh, advance some more things so I want to try out a few different skills while we're doing this and I think we're at the point where if I can get a 100% uh, uh, magic reduction illusion set I think I could level illusion really really quick to uh, Paragon a few times I think I did 
that when I played this on uh, PS4. It's pretty much you cast the uh, the max level. Oh, there's a bunch of guys. Can we get one in there? But uh, yeah, you cast the max level uh, pacify in uh, the center of Riften, and it hits so many people in the middle of the day that uh, it levels up like ten levels every time you cast it. It's pretty pretty crazy. And you don't need any perks invested in illusion except for uh, uh, actually none of them. Just because you have the armor. And I'm just not sure how I can level uh, destruction at this point. Since everything hits so hard, I can't really get close to them without getting one shot. Oh, hardened armor. That's kind of cool looking. Uh, let's see what we got going on here. There's something over there. Let's get this glowing mushrooms. Check out this area. Uh, another researcher. Absolutely nothing. Sword and war axe. Nothing there. Alright, that was that wall. Is that a chest? No. Just a little little thing on the wall. Alright, we go up this way. This is a pretty big dungeon for uh for the mage go. And we got another one of those spits. Pets up in there. Uh, let's see. Let me see while we're here. Not much. Alright. Lots of egg sacks. We love those. Ooh, a chest hidden back here. Magic potion. Uh, let's grab these glowing mushrooms. I'm uh, trying to plan out uh, all the different potions that are worth making for. Uh, I want to try a survival run doing uh, melee. And uh, I'm trying to figure out like what potions are good, what, how to, what's the best way to go through <laughs> with it. Right now, I can't decide between a Nord or a uh, Orc. For uh, all other race, I want to be. It's like the hardest decision. Like you get the uh, the 25 bonus to warm, so you'd have like uh, what is that? I can't remember what the max armor armor warm is, but you get 25 on top of that. So let's, let me look that up real quick. What bonus. Fifty-six warm as a uh, as a Nord, which is I think the highest you can get without uh, potions and uh, other stuff. Okay, we hit an encumbrance limit. All right, we can get rid of these belted uh, tunic belt. We're gonna keep that Falmer helmet. What kind of weapons we got? We got Iron Dagger. Let's go ahead and drop those. What? Are, I think that Dwimmer, Dwimmer stuff is weighing us down. Yeah, we got a ton of, ton of that on us. Okay. 
I think we're uh, hopefully we're towards the end of this. I want to come back through. Oh, a master lock. I want to come back through here and get all the all the metal at some point. But yeah, I can't decide between a Nord or an Orc. An Orc gets, I believe, fifteen. So that'd be. Uh... Oh, found it. Oh gosh. An Orc would just be uh, ten less than the uh, Nord, but they also get the. Uh, power to reduce damage by 50% uh, and increase damage by 50%. So it's like this pretty insane, uh, oh god, keep messing that up. And I'm out of lockpicks, never mind. But yeah, it's hard to, <laughs> hard to decide on what to be. Nord doesn't really have uh, much else than that. They get 50% resist frost, but then you could also go Breton and you Breton has the 25% magicka resistance, which to me that seems like a pretty uh, pretty beefy uh, ability. I have that on this character. I made her as a as a Breton, and it's this uh, right here, 25% uh, resist magic, which is pretty intense. I think Breton's one of the only. Uh, only raises that can hit the uh, resistance cap without much effort. And I think that's like 80%. Alright, we gotta get pets out. Yeah, that one's got a wand or something. Alright, while well, that's going on, let's see if we can drop. Those aren't that heavy. I could sort by weight. There's a large strut that's worth 15. Let's just drop them here. Yeah, those will be there forever, so it doesn't really matter. Alright. I'll get a uh, get a follower and come back and loot all this stuff. It's a lot of lock picks too. Oh, down there. I think the bodies will go away. Spikes. I can carry it now that I got rid of all of that. Uh, the Wimmer. I'll have to go back to the house and smelt all that down real quick. Uh, is this a usable door? Yes, it is. I'm trying to remember where we were. Yeah, we're in. Uh, South of uh, Windhelm. Can't remember what the zone's called in ESO. Like East March. Oh, another researcher. We're going the right way. Oh, and a whole different zone. Oh, that one looks pretty epic up there. Let's see if we get a up there on him. Okay, I don't see anything. Oh, he's got a pet. And it's just a grim uh, boom lurk lurker. Sky, some gold. All right, lots more of the uh, metal laying around. Jeez, it's gonna 
take days to get it all out of here. Right, we got more of them over here. Oh, they're not gonna go out there. There we go. Four mobs in this one. Let's do a Q. Okay, there's one. Get a little, uh, geez. Lightning bolts in. On. Uh, what are they gonna go fight? This one? Warmonger. Oh god. Warmonger sounds like one shot. Magica and a minor healing. Q, that's three. I think both of them went down. Might as well jump both back on. Releasing crystal from her. Some ore. A staff of fire bullets. Alright, we're gonna have to try out that staff. Let's do, let's do three. Let's get that staff in our main hand for right now. I'll try it out. Let's go up this way. I believe this is the way we need to go. Oh, it's got like smoky, uh, Or at the top of the staff. Uh, Amulet of Zenitar. 10% better prices and a ring of regeneration. Nice. Hopefully, I can break those down into enchantments. Requires key. Okay, I guess we gotta go look for a key to this room now. And it's gonna be one of these ways, maybe this way. Oh, let's see. That's a master lock. Can't pick that. Gonna need a key for that one too, I guess. There's like some broken spiders over here. Oh, another researcher body. Pretty cool, okay. So this might be the way to go. Let's get our pets back. So the mana can be regenerating. All right, we've got lots of metal in this room. Not much else. Could be a trap, I don't know. Alright, looks like we're doing good. There are dead Falmer, so something killed the Falmer. 
is uh, interesting because they're pretty strong. Grab the gold. Oh crap. Dwarven Centurion Master. Get rid of that staff. I think lots of magical potions. So we can... Hopefully, get a few bubbles up from this. Level though, but he's got a dynamo core, gear, flawless, soul gem, and a lever, uh, ear and gold. Yes, please. Ooh, there's a lot of loot in this room. Two ears on that one, surprisingly. There's the key we're looking for gold. We're gonna leave. Leave that dwarven shield, it's a little too heavy for what we need right now. We'll take that because they're not way much. We'll take the ignits. Stone chair, don't need any of that. We'll have to bring a follower to come pick all this stuff up. Or at least whatever can be smelted down. Uh, let's go to here. A book, no. All right, we got a potion of minor stamina, potion of lock picking, and a bed. <laughs> Guess if this if this was uh, survival mode, you could take a little nap there and uh, re replenish some fatigue because this is a long dungeon. All right, let's keep going back. We need to run back up there actually. Unless this becomes a trap room. We're good. Alright. So, let's try the key on this side door over here. If it was a master lock, it might unlock with that key before we go to the final door. No. Alright, what do we got going on up here? Oh, chest. Ebony war axe. We don't have room for that. Let's just take that stuff. We got some bird eggs. Oh, and we're over encumbered now. Let's look at our weapons. Huh. What can we get rid of? Let's go right, jeez. Let's go right here. Let's drop some heavy uh, dwarven metal. It's two weight. Yeah, this is 25 pounds. Let's drop that. We can always come back for it. Uh, we were going up there. Okay. And more dead Palmer. I'm assuming there is a uh G Gavros, is that you? I'd almost given up hope. Let me get the door. Nope. What the what are you doing here? What have you done with Gavros? Was the Falmer, wasn't it? Curse them! If Gavros is gone, there is no hope. 
He was supposed to return with the crystal. Without that, all our efforts are wasted. And you, if you're here for treasure or wisdom or anything, I'm afraid you've wasted your time. It didn't work the first time. I tried to tell Gavros, but he wouldn't listen. No, it won't be too cold, he said. Well, I was right, wasn't I? Focus completely wrong by the time we got here. The cold had warped it. Gavros had to cart it all the way back to Cyrodiil. Left the rest of us here to fend off the damnable Falmer. You found... How in the world? That's it? That's it! I don't know who you are, but you may have just saved this little project. In fact, who are you anyway? College? You are, are you? Savos wouldn't even grant us an audience when we came to you. But now you come here expecting something from me? I don't much like this, I'll tell you. But you saved my skin, so maybe I could overlook the past. But... <laughs> come on, I'll explain on the way. All right. I think no matter we're good what Gavros said, this was my idea first. The council is going to know that. What is I this? This guy's got his little I was the one who hobble over this, here. This oculory. What's he got going on here? A book? Potion? I don't know what the dwarves called it. Something unpronounceable, I'm sure. Yeah. It seems they were intent on discerning the nature of the divine. This machinery, all of it, was designed to collect starlight. And then, I'm not sure. I think I remember this quest. It's like uh puzzle you gotta line up everything. Yeah. You gotta click uh I don't remember the order. It's gonna suck. Frostbite tome, flames tome. Yeah, I remember now you gotta You gotta like do Fire and ice on those. Alright, I already had those. Come on, dude. Don't have all day. something from me are you well I'm afraid I can't help you with that I need the crystal to do anything useful and I don't have it you found how in the world that's it that's it in fact who are he you just, anyway he just told us all this. you are uh, Savos wouldn't even grant I don't much come on I'll explain on the way all right I guess he wasn't done walking here it is. Magnificent, isn't it? Took an incredible amount of work to get it running again. Now I'm hoping it'll all be worth it. Okay. Place the crystal in the central apparatus, and we can start the process for focusing it. Up there. There we go. Focus it now. That's... Trying to remember. I gotta get him to hit one, two, three. So those three beams have to hit those three things. I think it's like one, one, two, something like that. And then like over here. Like that. What's the journal say? Focus the. That I clicked it. Oh. Uh, let's try this one. No. That just moves the uh, that one. I need to move these. Why aren't they moving? Uh, see, magic. 
flames and frostbite. There we go. Okay. <laughs> totally a loss on trying to remember how to do this. Closer than that. And then let's see if we can get the top one over there, maybe. I'm gonna get that one. I feel like I need to be able to click this. Wait, doesn't this move? This isn't moving. Which I'm missing. No. Huh. Can I jump up to that one? Oh, there we go. That moved it. Finally. the top one. Can I move it? No, it goes too far. How do I rotate the entire... So I'm 
going to uh, try to figure this out. <laughs> I'll be right back since this is just going to take me a little bit. Alright, after a bunch of fire and ice, uh, I was able to get the beams to line up in the center. Now we just need to get them all the th different uh, circles in the right spots. So we gotta get this one to right there. And that took, uh, I used fire to get it to one extreme and then I hit it like three or four times with a uh, boss. Alright, so we got the uh, first one. Second one is way over there, so. We gotta go all the way around. a lot of trial and error to get that to line up just right. And one more. Got that one. And where is this one? Alright, it's going to come around. One more, I think. Perfect. Now we talk to uh, the dude. What's this? These results, they're not at all what they should be. This projection should be lit up like the night sky. Something is creating an incredible amount of interference. Something in Winterhold, it looks like. What are you playing at? Is this some attempt to stall my work? So what is it? What have you done? Did you know what we were attempting? Are you here to make sure your plan worked? that our efforts have been for nothing? Well, explain yourself. Better calm you down. You college have ruined years of my work. I've lost colleagues and friends to the former, and you want me to calm down? How did you do it? I truly have no Either idea what you're talking to about. Me, or you have something at your college, don't you? Something immensely powerful, beyond anything I've anticipated. What is it? Um... The Eye of Magnus? Well, I suppose if that means what I think it does. Well, that's interesting. Yes, the staff. Can you help me find the staff or not? I can't explain the details. That would be giving away many secrets the Synod have learned over the years. Also, I doubt you'd be able to comprehend the details. Have you seen the orrery in the Imperial City? It was the inspiration for this idea. Instead of projecting the sky, we what project island? all oh, that's the, uh, and then the Mary Dominion Island. Energies to overlay the positions of what's in Cyril, is that all of this work was elsewhere. designed to reveal to us sources of great magical power. Black Marsh, Purely to help safeguard the Empire, of course. Skyrim. And in the end, only two locations and, have been revealed uh, to us. One is your college. This one is the uh, other. Well, that can only be Labyrinthian. Daggerfall. So, mage from Winterhold, despite your intentions, I've beaten your little game. Even if all you've said here is lies, I know you have something in Winterhold the Synod Council will be very interested in. So, fine. Trudge off to Labyrinthian in search of your staff. I think I'm gonna have to I kill this dude. I shall return to Cyrodiil and deliver my full report to the council. This is not over, I assure you. Uh... Well, yes. I mean, yes. The council will be informed of this. They will find... I think I've... Your trickery won't confuse me. I think I should kill him. I feel like that's the great answer for this. Um, let's get... Visibility in our main hand. Oh. You've got what you There we go. I was wondering why I couldn't hit him. Junk. Alright. 
we have what we need. We know where the staff is, and he's not going to go tell his little friends in Cyrodiil where, uh, what we got going on. Alright. Anything of value to loot from his looty area? Nope. Not really. Whoa. What's this? You have done well thus far, but trying times are ahead. It is imperative that you return to your college at once. Okay. You will be called on to take swift action. Rise to the challenge and discover what you are capable of. You are on the right path, and you will prevail. Right. This guy can like transcend time. Alright, what do we got going on here? It looks like an exit. Wow, where are we? What? <laughs> We're way up in the mountains. Okay. Let's quick save here because I have no idea where we're at. Is that giant statue around here? Hmm. What's over here? 